good morning and welcome to Storm Bert. I've just cast out, therefore it's my first cup of tea of the day. A couple of tips or pointers when it comes to fishing storms. First of all, safety is very, very important. Actually, it's important all the time, isn't it? Where you fish, the position, your location, all of those things, very, very important indeed. And I do mention that quite a lot in my blog because it's an important drum to keep banging. Common sense, isn't it? You don't go somewhere that's going to put you at risk. Could be a river that's in flood, nothing wrong with fishing that type of environment. In fact, can be quite productive, but not if you're in the wrong place. So first of all, safety. Health and safety, I suppose we'd call it these days, wouldn't we? But just safety, although it could affect your health, of course, if you get swept away in a river, that's for sure. Secondly, though, as far as the actual fishing's concerned, don't let it stop you going. But choose somewhere, not necessarily from the safety aspect, we've already covered that one just, but from a perspective where you can actually present debate. I know venues in my wider local area that would be totally unfishable today. The winds are due, they are picking up now, they're due to get into the 40 mile per hour plus bracket very soon. In fact, I think <laughs> they're on the way there definitely. And it's very, very heavy rain. But as far as the winds are concerned, I know places that would be totally unfishable now. I wouldn't even be able to see the float. It would be like fishing the sea on a rough day. You wouldn't be able to fish at all. But I'm actually watching the float, a small waggler in the water. And that's because I've chosen not only the right location in terms of the venue, but also the right location when I'm on the venue. Because even on some places, that bank would be a no-go area, but this side, would be okay and that's exactly what I've got here because there are parts of this pool that you wouldn't be able to present a bait effectively on however where I am now it's absolutely fine so a couple of pointers there for fishing in storms obviously safety that's the most important thing isn't it and especially in that context of your life and looking after yourself that's obviously important but then secondly don't necessarily stop fishing during adverse conditions but once you've taken the safety aspect into account make sure you're on a venue where you can fish effectively and properly where I am now I know this place that's why I'm here because I know the wind direction I know that it's sheltered relatively speaking and I know that I'll be able to have a couple of hours and hopefully get some fish on the bank as well.